Hey guys, it's me, Myrie Barnes, and I am back with another video. Today is Wednesday, October 2nd, and it's currently 3.02 p.m., and I have baby Benji here for you all. This is my first video I am recording in October, but it is not my first video I'm going to be uploading in October because I have like three or four videos that I have not edited yet but i had made them in september but i'm going to be editing them today while i am off for my last day and then i go back to work tomorrow sadly and i want to have them uploaded in the next couple of days for you all so i just got back from my trip well i got back technically yesterday but i was just so tired so i didn't do anything and i didn't interact with the babies or anything like that i just really laid down and then today I am doing this video for you all, but yeah, I just got back from my trip. I had took a small mini vacay. I kind of called it like my birthday present. I had went to see one of my favorite artists who is Nicki Minaj. I love, love, love Nicki Minaj. And I had saw her and it was amazing. I saw her over the weekend. It was so amazing. It's a fun, great experience. And then I also got a chance to see Towns, who is a Nigerian singer. She sung so beautifully live. It was so, so amazing. Like the whole experience was a 10 out of 10. I would definitely be seeing both of them again. Whenever they decide to do another tour, because they're both on tour right now, but both tours are ending. But if they ever decide to go on tour again or do a concert, I would definitely go because both were 10 out of 10 experiences. And I was lucky enough to get four seats for both. I was like first slash second row for Tums. And then I was, ooh. I would have floor seats for Nikki, but I wasn't as close as I wanted to be. So definitely floor seats and getting closer next time. Anyways, that's enough about me. This video is actually going to be about you guys. While I change baby Benji, you guys know I am babysitting him. And my friend is actually selling him. He isn't too happy. He's like, why did you leave me here with these people? You know I don't know them. That's what he's upset about. Let me show you guys what he's going to be wearing. So it took me a long time to figure out what I wanted him to wear. Because, like, I, I don't have anything. Like, I do have stuff. I know you guys, when you guys saw my little uh, shorts video of the closet, you guys were like, oh, my gosh, girl, you have too much stuff. But in my, like, reality, I have nothing. I have nothing for them to wear. Like, I need to do a deep dive and a deep, like, stuff and just either give it away or sell it. I don't know. But it's so much stuff in there that I just, it's not my style anymore. So, anyways, he's going to be wearing this shirt. It's so cute. It says, cute version of daddy. And I got it from the uk yeah but the brand is nutmeg i got it from someone from the uk i wish i could i know I, every time i bring out an outfit from the uk that i bought i always say i wish i could find the person that's i bought it from because they have so many great stuff for really really good price and i don't know their instagram but i know i don't know if they're still selling but yeah shipping is probably a lot more expensive not to anyways I'm, i paired it up with these shorts this is not the shorts that go with it these are just regular carters uh, child of mine zero to three months short and i thought that it looked really nice with this because i believe this came with a pair of pants but the pants that i had it matched up with were like too dark and then i was like okay i guess i can pair it up with some gray oh my goodness okay we'll just take that down um i was like i guess i could just pair it up with some gray sweatpants but i'm like that don't really look right that don't look cute and then luckily i looked around and i found these because i have so much stuff that's not even folded up and in the shelves and things like that but anyways, I'm going to go ahead and change him. We're going to take this plastic baggie off his head just to protect his beautiful, amazing hair. So he has no hair loss when he goes home to his new mommy or daddy, whoever they may, whoever that may be. Again, as always, if you are contacting me to get you in contact with her, please be respectful of her time. But yeah, this little one is available. I'm moving the blanket. All right. Okay, so I have these nails on, so I'm going to be very, very and extremely careful with changing him. They are press-on nails. If any of my friends out there like press-on nails, these are great. 10 out of 10. I don't wear nails. I'm not a really a girly girl, but I wanted to spice it up for the concert a little bit. So I got these from Nicki Minaj, and they're amazing. These are a 10 out of 10. They come in a really cute fancy box. These are like $13, which is not bad at all. It comes with nail glue, filer, this little cuticle thing. It comes with, I think 24 or 28 nails. So it comes with extra nails and yeah, 
It's Pink Friday 2 nails or Pink Friday nails. You guys can find her. She has a website. I will say the shipping took really, really long. That's the only complaint. But otherwise than that, great nails. Okay. Anyways, we're going to change Baby Benji. And I want to talk about you guys. How are you guys doing? I feel like I don't really interact with you guys like I used to. I feel like a lot of people are not active anymore. And you know what? I honestly, I don't blame them. And I don't blame them because this community has been something else. And it hasn't been the best, honestly. It has not been a great community. And I know I'm going to get like some, what? Like, what are you talking about? But it's just been drama filled. And yeah, sometimes the drama is a little fun to watch and whatnot. But when it's constant, it's every day. That's when I'm like, okay, this is just negativity just a whole bunch of negativity and i know a lot of people have been leaving the community or just not as active because of it and so i really want to know how you guys are doing how you guys are feeling let's spread some positivity for once what have you guys been up to anything exciting have you guys got any new babies if you guys don't want to talk about the community what's something that you've done over the weekend like i told you guys i just got back from my trip seeing two great artists perform live that was great for me uh, i do have one baby on the way and then i have some blank kits coming and so that is pretty much what's up with me i know i don't really tell you guys when i have new babies coming but i do have a new baby coming hopefully soon and yeah, I can't wait to share that baby with you all. But yeah, I just wanted to see how everyone was doing and just wanted to check in. I know there has been a few hurricanes lately, so I hope everyone is staying safe, warm. Um, hope you guys are taking care of yourself. And I just hope everyone is just, you know, living life like there's no tomorrow because tomorrow is never promised. So. Hope everyone, again, is staying safe. I don't really know much about anything else that is really going on. Even though I do have social media, I'm not on it 24-7, especially when, like, I'm at work. I can't really be on my phone. So I've been, like, kind of out of the loop. So whatever is happening, hope every like I said, I hope everyone is staying safe and... Yeah, guys, let me know what you guys are... Okay, I'm trying to button these up, but I'm just wasting time. <laughs> let me know what you guys, like Like I said, how are you guys feeling? And let me know if there's any new babies on the way or anything exciting like that. Again, this little one is available for sale by his mommy. I am not his mommy, so I cannot give out any pricing details or information like that the only thing i can do is like i said get you in contact with her and again remember to be respectful and remember to try to not waste time this is not a cheap baby and this is not a cheap hobby so again if you're looking to spend just a few hundred dollars then this is not the baby for you I'm struggling. I'm struggling. Guys, I tried to take these nails off yesterday. And they didn't budge. One of them budged a little bit. But as you can see, I still have all of them on. And they're intact. So, if you guys know a way. Well, this video probably won't be uploaded for a while. By then, they probably, hopefully, fingers crossed, falling off by then. Because I, I can't work with these on. It's going to be very hard, extremely hard to work with these on. So, like I said, hopefully they'll be off. But if they're not off by the time you guys see this, if you know any ways that I can get these things off, please, please, please let me know by commenting down below. And, yeah. I don't have a topic for this video. Again, I, this is really just a wellness video. I wanted to, again, check in and see how everyone was doing, how everyone is feeling. Honestly, my trip had boosted my spirits a lot because I have just been working so much. I just needed a break. I needed a break. And what but what other way to do that than 
going to see your favorite artist perform live for you. So that was a great experience for me. And yeah, guys. But I'm, <laughs> yep, gotta go back to work, Sally. Right away tomorrow, and I'm not ready. Work takes up like so much time and takes up literally my whole day. And it's not fun at all. The only thing fun is those checks. <laughs> and I'm not making money anywhere else, so I have no choice. I have no choice. Okay, let's see. And I, I hope it's not looking like I'm being rough with him on camera. I know a lot of the times it does look like I'm being rough with the babies and for a lot of you guys as well. But I know, like in person, we're like being super, super careful. But on camera, it looks like we're just like throwing them around. <laughs> but that's not the case at all, I promise. If I can't get these buttons, I'm just going to leave them. I'm just going to leave them. I'm just going to leave them. We're going to leave them. I can't get them. I'll button it up later. But yeah, guys, I didn't originally... Like, I wanted to change him so, so bad. But then I'm like, no, I can't really be changing him and playing with him like that. <laughs> and so... I checked and it showed that I actually haven't changed him in a while. Like, a month. Like, since I got him. And so I was like, okay, I could change him. It's a jump. You guys are looking at the cloth diaper and other stuff drawer. That's what that is. I have the cloth diaper that he was wearing in here just so I don't move this. I can make sure I send it back with him. But, but yeah. Back to him. He looks so cute. And these shorts, they fit him really good. They're not big at all. They're just like long. But I'm just gonna go like this. Oh, he's so cute. Cuter version of daddy. He's adorable, guys. I don't know how he's still up for sale. I really don't. I do have... Passy for him and a cute little... Cute little friend. I think we're gonna go with... This one? It's a... Uh, it's a biz pacifier. I used to really like and be into pacifiers. So anytime like I seen like really cute and good pacifiers, I used to always just want to get them. But now I'm not really into like the accessories, except shoes. I still love the shoes for the babies, but like pacifiers and all that great jazz. Eh, not really. I don't really care for them as you guys can see. None of my babies, well, I said, as you guys can see, you guys can't see except for one baby, but I'm, I just looked around the room and none of my babies have a pacifier on. I can't remember the last time I put a pacifier in a baby's mouth. So yeah, but this one is like, uh, I cut it. Who did I, I think I cut it for Alina. And she has like a cut like mouth. And he does have an open mouth and he even has a tongue in there. So this would be like perfect for him. I'm not going to put it in his mouth. But that's his little buddy. And I did have socks for this outfit as well as hand mitts. But I don't think I'm going to put them on. Because he just looks so cute like this already. Let me see that one more because He is so cute. He's a good size too. I told you guys in the last video. But he's seriously a good size. I just grabbed these white and gray striped hand mitts. But he's like so realistic. You want to make sure I get that pinky in there. It's so hard to do anything with these nails on. I couldn't even open the door to the to the Tesla. So as you guys know, you have to like press in and then the handle comes out. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I want to take a picture and send it to her. He looks so cute. Oh my gosh. Now 
one's a lot easier because this one's this hand's a fist and then this hand's open. Here, let me see. Look at your friends. Say hi, friends. Say hi. My name is Baby Benji, and I am the Connor Scope by Jennifer Costello, and I want a new home. Say so you want a new home. But say so you love being here with your GT. I'm not forcing him to say that, by the way. This is coming straight from him. He loves being here with me. Yep. <laughs> he loves being here with Auntie and his cute outfit and all of his cousins. And his amazing hair. So soft. So beautiful. You don't even have to do it. Like, I don't even have to do his hair. Look at that. I'm so cute. So, so cute. Do you want your rocker on? Oh, is it plugged in? I don't know if it's plugged in. Anyways, say I don't need it on. It makes me nauseous. <laughs> That's me changing baby Benji. And again, he is available, not cheap. And if you want to get into contact with his mom, just go ahead and message me. You guys can message me on Instagram or my email, which is always linked in the description below. And I always say yeah at the end of the videos as well. But, uh, yeah. So, that's him and his cute little outfit. Uh, the shirt is, I believe, a newborn size. And then, like I said, the pants are zero to three months and they fit him really good. So, that way you guys can get a good size. A good idea of his size. But, yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. Let me know, like, how you guys are doing. How you guys are feeling. If you guys got any new babies in the way. Anything exciting. What you done over the weekend. Let me know, guys. Because this is the time to be spreading love and positivity. And uh, the holidays are coming up, which I know is a lot of fun and exciting times for most. And then it can be also sad times for others. So let me know how you guys are feeling. And uh, yeah, hopefully I can get a lot of videos pushed out for October. And uh, yeah, fingers crossed. Anyways, if you guys want to go ahead and follow me on Instagram, my Instagram is Maya underscore Reborns. And if you guys like this video, get a big thumbs up. Comment down below anything you guys want in the comments, including video requests. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, ring that bell so you guys can always be notified when I post another video. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.